It takes a bank to help a bank. First Federal Savings and Loan in Pascagoula is raising money so others can get back to managing money. The Bank of Anguilla was among the businesses at homes devastated by recent tornadoes in North Mississippi and the Delta. But as Mike Lacey reports, thanks to a little help and a lot of love, the bank is back in business. The Bank of Anguilla, just six miles north of Rolling Fork, was right in the path of destruction. Three of its 28 employees have no homes left. Many more are severely damaged. The easiest thing we could have done, I guess, is to write a check and put it in the mail and try to help the Bank of Anguilla out that way. But sometimes it takes physical work to get back into fiscal shape. At least that's what the employees of First Federal Savings and Loan of Pascagoula prefer to do. Since we are nationally recognized as the best bank to work for, our employees have always pitched in to help each other, and now we're having the opportunity to help another bank in another area. So we just consider them part of our group now. First Federal employees worked hours preparing more than 500 fish plates and all the sides. Thank you so much. Prepaid customers lined up to receive the meals and some even added an extra cash donation. The relationship between First Federal and Bank of Anguilla began just a short time ago. We were working with them on a statewide um, blood drive, Battle of the Banks blood drive for this summer and had formed a relationship with them on that like a week before the tornadoes. President and CEO Alan Renfro knows how important a bank is in a community that's been devastated. Your customers are certainly depending on you to be there to help them when they need their money, whether it's $10 to go buy a little bit of gas or a gallon of milk, they need you to be able to provide that $10. So yes, they want you to, to have your doors open and be able to help them as needed. In Pascagoula, Mike Lacey, WLOX News Now. The money will be put in the Bank of Anguilla Employee Benefit Fund to be used as needed.